Hey guys, today we get to talk about the infinite cat combo that is never to be because they banned the incorrect card. So Sahili Ra, four color Sahili Ra cat combo was one of the most dominating decks out of all the top decks. It had was 40% of the winning 5-0 for one decks. Therefore, it needed to be banned, but unfortunately, they banned the Guardian. Now, if they had banned Sahili, which I believe they should have done that, uh, mainly for the fact that it would allow this combo to exist in Standard. Now, this combo is no longer, and it's very sad because then it's a null infinite cat combo, but much more difficult to pull off. So, what you're going to need is you're going to need your Cat Lord, the Regal Karakot which is free double white. All the cats you control get plus one, plus one, and have lifelink. Whenever Regal Karakot enters the battlefield, create two one one white cat creature tokens with lifelink. So pretty, pretty slow, because you're also need, going to need Panharmonicon for if an artifact or creature, in this case a creature, enters the battlefield, causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control to trigger, the ability triggers an additional time. And you're gonna need two guardians. So this is a four card combo. It could be mono white, but I'm assuming that you want some cycling and maybe a little bit uh, different colors. And it's really sad that they didn't really consider this combo. They just kind of banned the guardian. Had they allowed the guardian to exist, I feel like that would have been the better strategy and then they could have banned Sahili. Now Sahili is the promotional planeswalker, he's the mythic planeswalker, but it's not like they didn't ban Emiko before. And Emiko was the entire story of the block. So when we talk about what they could have banned and what could have been, we have had a fun fun FNM cat tribal deck with an infinite combo win. That would be amazing. The first time I believe we ever would get a competitive or a tier, you know, tier four standard deck that ran off cats. But instead, they banned the Guardian instead of Sahili. I think that was a mistake because this was going to be the best combo FNM deck that never was. I can imagine just how many people would want to play this deck, how fun it would be. But it is never, it's never to be. So here's how the combo works. Part Harmonicon doubles enter the battlefield triggers. You have the Guardian, uh, so you're going, we're going to call him Guardian 1, G1. Pan Harmonicon and the Cat Lord. You play a second Guardian, G2. All G2's abilities trigger, so Pan Harmonicon puts two copies of the effect on the stack. You target G1 and the Caracol, they come back. Caracol makes four tokens, two doubled, and G1 comes back and targets the freshly summoned Caracol and G2. The Caracol comes back and makes four more tokens. You repeat step four and five until you have enough tokens. You now have infinite tokens. Your opponent has a turn to interact with this in some type of board wipe fashion. But this would have been an epic deck. It would have been so fun to play with. I could see Saffron Olive running like this. Just It's one of these decks that we need to have. It's like a trolley deck. It's a type of deck that you can spend all FNM trying to pull this off once. And as long as you pull it off once or even once a month, it's worth it. It is so worth the fact that you can win the game with like this. We could have had a combo deck and standard but we, they banned the wrong card. They should have banned Sahili. That would have took out the combo that they were really afraid of. And then people could play the fun cat combo. I believe they just, they did not ban Sahili because she was the mythic planeswalker. I mean, it would be so odd, right? Not that it's not happened before of Emiko, where all the merchandise and all the promotion material was Emiko this, Emiko that, and they hyped Emiko 
or her, as Emiko is actually a she, as I've been told many times. And then they banned her. So at the end of the day, I love this cat combo. It is so sad that it will never see the light of day in standard. Now you might say, oh, well, we can play this in modern. No, you're not going to be able to play this in modern because modern is too fast. Now, and the card power is much, much higher than it would be in standard, especially given that I'm a cat. So this is interesting because the cards... I mean, the cards that you want, the Cat Lord is an Armor Cat, and it would have been a really fun card. It would have been interesting to see the price on the card should this be even a casual deck. Having as much casual appeal as Infinite Cat Tokens the hard way would have been good because this would uh, still allow a combo deck to exist. What I'm saying is I don't believe Wizards of Coast took enough time to consider I mean, they said that they collected data in two days and then they decided, hey, that's enough for us not to, not even less than two days, right? It was at least Monday and then they made the announcement from uh, Wednesday night. So I'm really disappointed that we don't get this combo in and they could have easily allowed it. And this is not a powerful combo. This is a very slow combo needing four pieces. It needs four pieces. And the good thing about this combo is if you can't combo off, you do have this potential to be cat aggro. I mean, that's just so fun. But instead of examining what is out there and saying, okay, maybe we'll let the cat people have the cat combo, but we'll just make it a ton more difficult and we'll, we will make it a cat lord instead. And now you'll need two guardians and you will need an artifact as well that costs four. So the Cat Lord is five, the two Guardians, I mean, you got to get two out of four cards in your deck. And then in cycling, it probably would be a lot better. The cycling makes it easier. I, I feel like this is this would have been an ideal deck to bring new players into standard. It just seems like a lot of fun and super casual. And I feel like I would have made the deck in foil. So instead of banning Sahili, they banned the Guardian, which destroyed this deck even before I got a chance. Now you might say, oh, well, you only complain about it now because I, I just have a, my gut feeling is you can bring a lot of casual players back to FNM if you had this combo going on. It's not as oppressive as the Sahili Raw cat combo. And it just looks like a ton of fun. It looks like something a casual player would want to build and standard and would want to play and then if they did it they would be a magic fan for life but unfortunately we had to uh, our wizard of coast decided to ban the incorrect piece of the combo in my opinion unless of course there is another sahili like card or another mimic card which then would be it would be uh, wow if they did this again so my premise my assumption is there is no other card coming in Hour of Devastation or in a set where these are legal together. Uh, Kaladesh is legal. Uh, not Kaladesh. Aether Revolt Kaladesh block is legal, which would mimic Sahili's effect. Because then that would be doubly terrible because then they didn't see the first time and then didn't see the second time, which would be awful. Uh, and then that would make sense that you would ban the Guardian if you did have another Sahili coming up in Hour of Devastation. However, I, I just cannot see that being true. They destroyed the most amazing cat standard deck in the history of Magic, even before it could be played. I mean, it was playable for two days on Magic Online because no one had the physical cards for this deck. Wow. what This is an epic loss. Uh, you probably think I'm kidding here. But I am not kidding because the amount of player, new players or casual players who would want this deck is high. I know because if you look at the cat prices of the Ajani and then I think there's another cat lord. These cats are very expensive for what they are. There's a lot of people who like cats and they would play this deck. I think it was a wasted opportunity to ban Sahili and they, they banned the wrong card. So anyway, that is my personal opinion. Let me know in the comments below. Would you have played this deck? Do you know someone who would play this deck? Am I just exaggerating and 
making a big deal of nothing or is this actually something that they should have considered was if they banned one part of the combo, Sahili, they could have saved a very fun casual deck. I mean, this deck is beloved already and might be beloved because no one's able to play it, but people really love this deck and the deck can't even exist. Um, so it is the number one post on Reddit and people love it. They just love this concept and who wouldn't love the concept of cats? Infinite cats, mono white, infinite cats, cat aggro. <laughs> I mean, just crazy. Anyway, leave me a comment below. Bye, guys.